Good morning, church, and be greeted in the name of our Lord Jesus. As we are sharing on the gifts of the Spirit, we know that God has given us the spiritual gifts to ultimately equip us to glorify Him. Today we will, we will be looking at the gift of evangelist. In the context of COVID-19, this gift is useful to encourage people's faith that God is near and that He is working to fulfill His purpose in us. To evangelize is to testify or to tell our stories or to share about the grace of God, especially with South Africa in the uncertain times. Even more, after the announcement of the president two days ago, the churches will remain closed. Someone need to remind us that we are still the body of Christ amidst not being able to go to church. We are church without walls. We need to tell our stories of how God is still at work outside of the church building. Remember, dear friends, that your story and my story is unique. That your Jacob moment with God during lockdown need to be shared. And how you, like Jacob, realize that the Lord has been with you and still is with you, even though you have wondered where he is. Our testimonies may be extreme and radical, and it might be a calm profession of true belief. Our stories to us and to the world will depict God's love, God's mercy, and God's care. God's Jehovah Jireh, His provision. In Mark chapter 5, verse 19, Jesus said, Now go home to your family. Tell them everything the Lord has done for you and how merciful He has been. Evangelize, sharing, telling our stories is a clear instruction from God. We can share hope in this time of hopelessness. Our hope is in the living God. God knows the tomorrows. Who is our eternal life? We are a nation who loves stories and unfortunately mostly gossip. And these days, fake news. But a testimony is a true story of where we met God, how God met us in the place of suffering, a place of joy, a place of where we wondered who will come through for us. Our stories is a story that where we didn't find any way, Jesus become our way. And yes, indeed, this morning, as we tell our stories, it will show people that God is a reality. Our stories today can help millions of people to see beyond their own little lockdown world that God is still with them. My and your story today can show that God is even greater than whatever we experience at this moment. It's not really about me, but it's all about the God who is at work, the God of the impossible, the God who promised to be there for us, the God who can do who, who can do what more, more than what we can do because he's a God who is able. As this background hymn, Blessed Assurance, Jesus is mine. I love the chorus which says, This is my story, this is my song, praising my Savior all the day long. You've got a story to tell. Share that with the world today, that God is alive. We give you thanks, Heavenly Father, that you've given us the gift of evangelization, that we can speak, that we can talk about your greatness, that we can share hope, that people can know you are God. In Jesus' name, amen.